Hey everybody, I just wanted to take a few minutes and create a video to show you how um, I would like it for you to use uh, the apps and websites that I've asked you to use in class. Now this is a sample class. I'm not necessarily asking you to do the all of these, um, but once you do a couple, um, I think it'll be pretty obvious, but I just wanted to take a little bit of time and do this. Now there should also be um, a discussion in Schoology for each period um, that would give you the specific um, codes for for the classes that you need to sign up for. Okay, so let's start with Remind. Now, Remind has an app that you can download on or to you can put on your um, your smartphone if you wish. But believe it or not, they also have a a program, okay, uh, a website. Um, so if you are a, you want to sign up as a student or parent if you aren't. Um, and then when you sign up as a student or parent, um, all you need to do is find the class the code that I have given you. Um, for example, some people have chem um, <laughs> period D per D. And look, it says, there it is, Mr. Walsh's honors chem period D. Or there's chem F per. Okay. Or I know that there's study hall period G. Okay. So there's all sorts of different codes. And then you're going to click, um, you're going to click join that class, chem per D okay and then you click join that class and there it is okay so that's pretty straightforward okay now on the list Educanon that's next so Educanon now Educanon because we're going to be using this to view videos and for me to get assessment back um, or to assess how well you understand stuff okay you're going to sign up for Educanon and when you do that um, Somehow it has, you click, I'm a student. And then when you do that, do not fill in any of this stuff up here. What you're going to do is you're going to click sign in with Google Plus, And then you're going to find um, that you have to enter my teacher code. Um, and then, um, which is located again in the Schoology. So don't use this. This only confuses things. Please use the Google Plus sign in because it makes it so much easier. And like the website says, you don't want to store a password, just click that below. Super, super straightforward. Okay. Plotly. Okay. Same thing. Free sign up. And then it says create an account. Don't put any of this stuff in here. You can sign in with G plus or sign up with G plus and then when you go to sign in you can use the G plus logo over here in the sign in okay so it makes it super easy that way you don't have to remember or memorize any sort of um, new password or new login okay and the last one is going to be Google Classroom and in order to join a class you're gonna come here and again you're gonna look for that class code that I give you um, for example Z7 K C Y Q and you would click join and you would automatically be able to join the class that you are associated with okay so once you get all those things done you should be all ready to go um, and we're all going to use these things in conjunction. Remind, I'm going to send out reminders for you. Educated is a video serving website that allows me to ask questions, so that's really cool. Plotly is the website that we use to make graphs and um, submit them through Google Docs or Google, your Google Drive. And then Google Classroom, we're going to use um, uh, with Schoology because Google Classroom allows for easy sharing of materials. Um, for all the students so um, so you can sign up for all of those okay so that's the little way to sign up for everything and I hope it's super easy for you